You had some pretty cool, cool teammates to, during your career. Um, one of those was Tony Gwynn. I did. Do you have one? Do you have one uh, big memory from Tony that really stands out to you? Mark Grant uh, did an interview with Chris Rose a couple weeks back, talking about how when Mud would throw batting practice to him, Tony would call out the pitch as he saw, you know, the arm slot and stuff. Do you have any cool stories about Tony? You know, I don't have any stories like that because I, I think as as time goes on, those stories get um, a little bigger. Uh-huh. But the uh, we, we stayed at a uh, um, I, I can't remember the name of it, but um, it was like a little motel type deal where the rooms were around the parking lot area where you, where you drive in it was all one level. And, you know, our rooms were completely around it. And there were players that would sit in their room with their doors open. Just so when somebody walked by, you know, there was, there was some reference there. And instead of having your door closed, the, the one thing I remember about Tony, I think, as much as anything, uh, isn't about him calling pitches or being the kind of hitter that he is. But anytime I ever walked by his door, he was always looking at video or playing a video game. And I think he was kind of the father of video replay because yep, – yep. Uh, he he really started it all, uh, at least for himself. And it was something that I wasn't interested in. I wasn't interested in playing uh, in playing video games, although I did indulge in Pong a little bit. I think that was the first one ever. Uh, that was kind of fun. But, you know, these guys really got, got into and, and are into video games nowadays. And it's just not something that I was ever interested in. You know, we had some guys that were instigators on our team, uh, me being one of them. Uh, I just remember Tony sitting in front of his locker and just laughing. You know, he'd never be one of the guys that was involved uh, in anything that used to go on or a lot of things that – used to go on within the clubhouse uh, with Bobby Brown and Champ Summers and Alan Wiggins. Uh, But Tony was always over there just watching and laughing. And my fondest memories of, of Tony is, uh, and we hear it all the time was uh, when you heard that laugh, you knew where it came from. Yeah. And that was, uh, that was uh, the best part. 